Hello everyone, I'm Sarah of Rich Textures Crochet and welcome. Today we are going to learn how to crochet the single crochet mesh stitch, which you can see here in front of you here. Now the stitches work similar to other mesh stitches out there. You might be more familiar with a double crochet mesh. Uh, unlike the double crochet though, this one has very few holes in it. The stitch design that is worked is quite pretty to look at with a very subtle texture. It's an easy stitch pattern to work uh, as it's made up of single crochet and chain stitches and it has a very similar feel to it as uh, the crochet moss stitch. So today we're going to learn how to crochet this mesh stitch. I'm going to be using a little bit of the Karen Times Pantone by Yarnspirations as well as a 5.5 millimeter crochet hook. So thank you so much for joining me. While you're here I invite you to subscribe and uh, take a look at some of the other video tutorials that you can find here. The written and photo instructions for this tutorial can be found for free on my blog at richtexturescrochet.com and the direct link is there for you in the description of this video. For our stitch today, it is worked in rows. We're going to start by making a slip knot and then making a foundation chain. And your foundation chain can have any even number of stitches. So today I'm going to begin by making a chain of 22. There's 15, 20, 21, and 22. Once you have your starting chain, the desired length, you're going to begin row one by working a single crochet into the second chain from your hook. So count in one, two, single crochet into the second chain chain one, skip the next chain, and single crochet into the next stitch. You're going to repeat that, chain one, skip the next chain, and single crochet into the next stitch. Repeat that all the way across, working your final single crochet stitch into that final chain. At the end of row one, chain one and turn your work. Now for row two, you're going to begin by working a single crochet into that first stitch. So into the stitch at the base of your turning chain, work one single crochet stitch, chain one, skip the next chain one space, and single crochet into the top of the next stitch. Chain one, skip the next chain one space, and single crochet into the top of the next stitch. You're going to repeat that all the way across, working your final single crochet into the final single crochet stitch. At the end of your row two, you can chain one and turn your work. And now for the rest of the pattern, you're simply going to repeat that row two. So single crochet into the first stitch, chain one, skip the next chain space, single crochet into the top of the next stitch. Repeat that all the way across, chain one and turn your work and begin again. And that's all there is to working this single crochet mesh stitch. I would love to hear how you have used this stitch in the past or would like to use this stitch. And uh, you can leave me a message there in the comments. So thank you so much for joining me and uh, I look forward to seeing you again next week for our next stitch tutorial. Until then, happy crocheting. Bye. Mm -hmm.